in this video of VB6 tutorials I will show you how to use sliders in VB6 so just you have to include the slider component by right clicking on the toolbar and searching for Windows Common Control 6.0 now click on apply close and in here you can find a slider control here uh, now I will use a text box and a timer to demonstrate uh, what happens when I increase the values of slider let me clear the text box uh, when, I, when a timer increments the text box value should also increment so I will use text box dot text equal to c c is a variable I have used to increment c equal to c plus 1 now we have to uh, declare c so I will use c as long now in form load we have to initialize c so i will initialize c as 0 now in slider action i will use if slider click i will use if slider1 dot value okay I will first uh, change the name to a smaller one so it will be easier to easier to use I will use S1 here and uh, uh, remove the previous code okay now here if S1 dot value equal to 1 then then timer one dot interval equal to uh, let me use here 100 and else if s1 dot value equal to 60 60 if s1 dot value equal to then timer1 dot interval equal to 60 and else timer1 dot interval equal to 20 now inform load event we have to initialize a slider one dot max equal to here we have used three and s one dot value equal to one. So let me run this code. Oh, okay. I forgot to put in def here. so as I change the values of slider here uh, the difference between the intervals I have generated is very low so you cannot feel uh, the ch changes so I will use a bigger numbers here bigger difference 600 and 2000 now let me show you code as you can see it is very slow here 
and I also forgot to tell you that the slider values are incremented from 0 so it will be 0 to 3 you can change it by yourself as uh, so the slider execution has been executed successfully thank you for watching tutorial thank you goodbye